But six capital improvements for one Kirksville commission are being put on hold temporarily at this afternoon's monthly meeting of the Kirksville Lakes Parks and Recreation Commission. Assistant City Manager Ashley Young gave an economic development sales tax update to the group. Last week, the Kirksville City Council agreed to let voters decide during the April 5th election if all of the excess revenue of about $600,000 for 2016 can go toward the new public tractor trailer parking lot at the Kraft Heinz plant. That's because the city didn't receive as much funding from the state as expected to help pay for that parking lot. As a result, all city capital improvement plans, including those for city parks, are being put on hold temporarily. Even though a few members expressed worries and debated about how this will affect things in the short term, the group knows that this needs to be done in order to help the city and the economy in the long term. I think that, in general, people understand that when you have tough decisions to make, that you have to take everything into account. And so the city is looking at how we are going to put the funds together to pay for this public parking lot that can be used by local truckers who do over-the-road trucking operations and then by the Kraft Heinz Company as part of their $229 million expansion that will add jobs to our local economy. Young also wanted to ensure the commission that the city will continue to push forward with master plans for the city's parks.